Here we are, Monday, August 21st, 2023. I'm Larissa Smith Video Diary. Oh my god. So I finished a painting yesterday. Blows me away. This one just like... This one just came together so quickly once I got it laid out on the canvas. Oh my god. Yeah. I'm, I'm gonna probably look at it today and talk about it directly, you know, while looking at it. Do a little recording. This one just turned out really well. <clears throat> sometimes, sometimes, sometimes I am impressed by my own work and I feel oh, it's the right word. Mm. Uh, I feel um, privileged to be a, to have been allowed to make it. It's not the right word. Privilege, not the right word. I don't know. It's like I got to be the person who made that one. Hey, it's it's outside of myself, kind of thing. Yeah. Yeah. I'm glad it, I'm glad this one's done. I wasn't looking forward to doing this one. I don't like thinking about the dream that it came from. And um I don't know. Maybe I can be done with that dream now. I don't know. It's not a violent dream at all. No, and I was thinking about today also this morning I was thinking about you know the book the the next volume of the book that I need to do or that I want to do with this series. So there's a there's a book that I've done that is images of the studies for all of the paintings that are going to be in the series, right? Um, and there's a poem that goes with each study. And I was I was thinking for the next book, the, the second volume, it's going, to, it's going to be images of the paintings, right? I was thinking I would write an essay about the about the dreams, but I don't think I'm going to do that. I think I prefer the abstract nature of the poems. And I don't want to necessarily share everything. Th these dreams, some of them are horrendously graphic. And, they're, they're, you know, they're not all nice dreams. As most people would call my dreams nightmares. But most of my dreams are. Um, not all of them, but most of them are. They're horrendous, right? They deal with horrendously violent things. Um, so I don't, I, I don't think I really want to write about that. I don't want to write about the, the, um, I, I'd like to leave the paintings, uh, a little more open to interpretation by the viewer and not spoon feed the viewer. You know, the, these aren't illustrations, right? This is not a, it's not like I'm writing a book where there's a story and, and, you know, you follow along. It's not an Ill this isn't an, an illustrated book, right? This isn't a, a graphic novel. Um, but I like, I like the, the, the poetry nature um, or the nature of the poetry and the way poems um, are word paintings, right? You know, they... they <sighs> and and, and I, I think that's what I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do. I'm just going to stick to... Leave leave some ambiguity to allow the viewer the respect of the viewer, right? In that they get to the view the viewer gets to have it, their own relationship with the painting. Um. Yeah, I don't want to be a controlling mom, <laughs> right? I want the viewer to be able to put themselves in the painting instead of having to see me in the painting, right? I want the viewer to be able to have a relationship with the painting. And if I tell them too much about, about it, 
it's like overdoing it. It's being controlling, right? This is what you must see when you look at my work. No, I don't want that. I don't want that at all. I, I want the viewer to be able to have their own story, their own experience, their own their own relationship to the paintings. So poetry it shall be. And I woke up this morning with some ideas for poems for the paintings that are already done. So I might start working on that today. Yeah. Maybe I'll start working on that today. Anyway, 